always give me advice so i'm gonna be the one that give y'all little young bitches advice i feel like a lot of y'all girls from the bronx reposted me and my sister pictures and everything and like it just it just made me kind of like like not even and um i have a lot of friends that they from brooklyn and they from queens and everything and we always arguing about like who's the better borough or whatever the fuck and they always be like oh bronx y'all bronx is dusty bronx is dirty y'all don't get money y'all don't get money and all that shit but i always say this bronx bitches we really like real pretty and i feel like we the definition of like diamonds in a rough diamond like diamonds in a rough and everything and i always say this shit because like um when i was younger i was always really into like fashion i used to go to school with heels and everything and like dressing different stomach out like dressing different stomach out i stole the trench coat from h&m bitch and i used to go like to school with my cute little trench coat with my different outfits that i used to steal from marshall's bitch yes yes bitch i had no choice but to steal it i don't give a fuck fuck you and then like i'm dealing with dealing with like you know the these little young niggas from the bronx or these little young niggas from washington heights like i started changing the way i dress and i started like unfocusing on what i liked which was my fashion which what i wanted to do so i um i always i started wearing like a lot of jordans a lot of Tims, a lot of pels then i started stripping and everything i started stripping and everything and i found myself trying to impress these dirty ass niggas that i used to date in the bronx so every single time that i would make a nice six hundred dollars five hundred dollars i would go buy some jordans i'll go buy some Tims. i would go buy some fucking shoes i would go buy some whatever the fuck whatever the fuck a pel whatever the crap up and and it was until I started like hanging out with these um like get money strippers like I'm 18 I'm 18 and I'm growing up and these girls are telling me like you need to change you need to change your swag up like there's more than just you you shouldn't be coming over here crying up crying over dirty ass over a dirty ass nigga dirty ass dick and there's motherfuckers out here that got money there's motherfuckers that I, I hear they got money you need to start dealing with these type of guys and everything so that's when i started instead of like saving money to buy boots and to buy fucking sneakers and shit i started saving money to invest in in good heels and good heels i started um learning how to do my makeup um, I started getting my nails done when I was 18. I barely used to get my nails done. Then I started hanging out with around, around women and I started getting my nails done, getting my, getting my, um, weekly pedicure because back then I used to like paint my own toenails. No bitch, get your fucking feet done. Like, w like hanging around with women molded me into becoming, uh, a woman. And I feel like a lot of you, you, you bronze girls, y'all don't, y'all don't have those women that mold you into becoming a, uh, uh, like a woman and everything. And I feel like sometimes I just be so stuck in the Bronx that I feel like y'all, y'all, y'all lose yourself and y'all don't realize that there's more than just, than just the hood. And I'm not telling y'all like, oh, go strip so y'all could be around women and everything, but like try to go get a job in downtown. So every single fucking day that you walk in your job, you could see these beautiful buildings and you could tell yourself every single day as a, uh, um, like, like, uh, every single time that you walk to your job and you see these buildings, I, I want y'all to like tell yourself, like, it's like one day I'm going to live in one of these apartments. One day I'm going to live in one of these apartments. I'm more than just the projects. I'm more than just the train station. I'm more than just the bus. I'm more than just shopping in Fordham Road. I'm more than just shopping in, in 181st Street. I'm more than just shopping in 3rd Ave. I want y'all to start watching YouTubes because back then I didn't have this. But I want y'all to start watching more YouTubes so y'all can learn more how to do your hair, how to do your wigs, how to how to maintain yourself because yeah yeah more than just the bronx i really hate to see a really pretty girl i one thing that i hate i really hate to see a really pretty girl have so much potential and have so much beauty and then 10 years from now it passed and you just another girl in the bronx in one of those apartments with a fuck ass nigga and not doing shit and 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 just like wasting yourself when y'all 
too fire, y'all too pretty, but y'all don't have a, a, a older cousin or y'all don't have an older bitch or y'all don't have an older sister or older anything to tell y'all that it's like, you're more than that. You're more than this. And I just want y'all to go get that. And I want y'all, I want y'all to get out that, that mentality. There's more than game banging. There's more than just these dirty ass fuck niggas. Like when you start fucking around with these, these, these guys that don't have shit, you start becoming a ain't shit ass bitch. Like you just start molding yourself to that because y'all don't re they, they don't let y'all reach y that potential and you, and you're more than that. You, you, you more than that. Sometimes y'all be seeing bitches. I know y'all be seeing bitches on Instagram that they be getting fluid out and they be all surgeryed up and they be fucking Chanel up. And it's like, how can I be that bitch? How can I be that bitch? You could be that bitch because you're pretty. You could be that bitch. You could be that bitch that have fucking everything. You just got to take your fucking mind out of your situation. You, 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 you could get out of there. Take take a fucking ride, get on the train, go downtown, walk for hours, see, I don't give a fuck, bitch, window shop and clean that shit. Like, it's like, how can I get this? How can I get this? How can I become this? Get out of your situation. You more than that. You more than Section 8. You more than going to 161st to get fucking food stamps. You more than that. You is more than that. And... This is this is strictly for my Bronx bitches because I know they all probably see me and y'all probably think like oh, like like it's probably luck it's probably because you smarter or something no bitch I was just a I was just a regular degular bitch like you walking the same fucking blocks bitch I had the same fucking mentality as you I always want to be in the mix I was one of those bitches they always used to be in fucking ENT parties I was one of those bitches in high school fucking cutting class I was one of those bitches that oh gang this gang that gang this gang 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 that and hanging around women older women that was getting to the money really strayed me away from that i feel like i feel like people a lot of bitches in brooklyn and in queens they they be surrounded by so much scammers and so much people that get money that they get to it that they get to it right away they know exactly what to do right away like in the bronx we don't really have like a, a influential person we always have probably like one person on the block that's getting money they don't talk to fuck you star <laughs> can i talk about black <laughs> we don't really have that many people that in the bronx that like get money like that so you don't really know what's money until you see it. And it's just like stray away from stray away stray away from that. Go get a job in downtown. And every single day when you fucking walk to the train station after your job, claim, claim shit, claim it, claim like I, I'm gonna live in one of these apartments one day. I'm gonna be able to buy that one day. I want you to do that. Cause you're more than that. And now y'all got so much resources. There's so many different ways. There's so many. If I had Instagram when I was fucking 18, 19, 17, 15, bitch, I would have been, 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 been rich. Find, 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 find your thing. My bad, y'all. I'm fucking. Mm. Mm. Ooh, I feel like an old bitch. I feel like an old bitch, because I know I'm 31, but bitch. I be getting heartburns, all this bullshit. Like, a bitch is sick. Like, I'm 31, but I feel a bitch feel 45. But anyways, like I was saying, claim it, bitch. Get, get, get out, get out your sector. Get out your fucking sector. Go get money, bitch. Learn how to become a fucking woman. Go to YouTube right now. Whatever the fuck you went to, nowadays you can YouTube it. Nowadays you can Google it. Take advantage of that. Get out of there. Get out of that weak bitch mentality. Get out of that little mentality. There's more to see. There's way more to see out here. I love you. I love y'all. I'm your older cousin. I'm your older sister. I'm the older friend that y'all never had. Star is texting me. And I love y'all. If y'all need a little advice, 
I don't always see my DMs, but I could always, you know, I'm there. Um, I'm about to go downstairs, eat me some fucking cereal, and I'm about to wake my daughter up so I can take her to school. And I love y'all. Bye.